and go to the big. Hello everyone, welcome back to another GTA video. Hello, hello, welcome back to another GTA video. Oh, I am going to tell you how to get a IA badge onto any saved outfit. Yes, any saved outfit right now in GTA Online, but the outfit that you would like to put it on must be already saved. Saved, you must have it as a saved outfit. This this does not require two consoles and net cut. This is very easy, very simple, and you can put it on to any outfit. Now, disclosure, I will sit there and say that if you did the telescope glitch to make a custom outfit, uh, it, by doing this, it will undo the telescope glitch. So unfortunately, and if you do redo the telescope glitch after completing this this tutorial oh, to get the IA badge, and uh, you would. Literally, a lose the IA badge on the outfit. So just keep that in mind. All right. So if you do this with a outfit, you did do the telescope glitch, and I will show you what I mean. And I will be equipping the outfit right now. I'm just wearing a Scooby Gear outfit. But first, what you want to do is take your vehicle, park it in this dot on the map which is the new missions in the game that involves the IA badge. It's going to be right here in this area where I am at on the map. And this does work on Xbox and PlayStation. So just right here on the map. So if you have to update your game and you have this the summer update then you'll have this these missions on your map. It's where the U icon is on your map so what you want to do is print just park your car in the middle of the circle and I'm gonna show you what I mean by the custom outfit it's so I'm gonna go to style and these are all my saved outfits so this here is my standard custom outfit mod it now I redid I remade this outfit using the telescope glitch and I was able to successfully make this one here. Now, if I had this outfit on to do the glitch, I will tell you now, I will lose the, the telescope part, which is going to be, which is on my head, the helmet and the mask. It does undo it. Uh, depends on what type of mask, what you did for the tel telescope glitch. It, what will stay and what will disappear here um all depends sometimes the mask will stay they or the helmet would stay and the mask would disappear or the mask would stay the helmet would disappear i it can vary depends on the outfit it now all you want to do is just equip a outfit that you did not do the telescope glitch on it has to be a saved outfit, something that you already have. So you just want to equip a saved outfit. So this is my saved outfit that I have on. On. So now that I have that on, all you want to do from here is create a playlist inside the game. So you want to open up your pause menu, go to online, go to playlist, create a playlist. And you just want to add any type of parachute job to your playlist. Doesn't matter which one, but it just has to be a parachute job. So you just want to add a parachute jump. And it can be any one of these. It doesn't matter which one it is. So you just want to add a parachute jump to it. Once you do so, you just want to go ahead and back it out till you get to the screen right here that says save playlist at the bottom and you want to save it and just give it a custom name. Okay. 
I would name this I A A Badge Two since I already made a playlist. I'm just making a second one for this video. So you just want to wait till that is done. Your playlist has been uploaded. So now my playlist has been made. Now from here all you want to do is go back into your interactions menu. Go to style. Accessories. And go to parachute and equipped a pair. Sorry you don't want to go to accessories. You want to go parachute just equipped a parachute. Doesn't matter what type of parachute just equipped one and then from there you want to get inside your car that is parked in the circle and you want to open up your pause menu go to playlist go to my playlist click on the playlist that you just made with the parachute job and you want to start it up up and I want to start spamming right on the d-pad as accepting this alert and if done correctly it will glitch out the job so it looks like you're going into the parachute job here but you're really going into the UPI I jobs so we're just going to you know, confirm everything Play. You want to go ahead and accept that you want to start up the job by yourself. You want to ready up. Now, it depends on which UPI mission you are in. You'll have a cutscene. If it's the very first one, you will have this cutscene thing. So, this cutscene is just going to play out. But as you see, my character does have the IA badge with my modded outfit. So now I just want to wait till this cutscene is over and I'll tell you the next part of the glitch. Now there's a total of six jobs. Now only the first one has this cutscene and the rest of them do not have the cutscene. It all depends on which one you are, but it does work with anyone. So my character does load outside with the IA badge onto my outfit. All I want to do now is make my way to my apartment. So I just want to get inside of my personal vehicle or inside of any vehicle oh, and make my way to my nearest by apartment and save the outfit and then quit the job using the phone in the game now before I quit the job I do want to equip the outfit a couple of times so once I do save it you just want to uh, equip it a few times before quitting the job using the phone inside the game so just make your way to your nearby apartment can be equip towers can pretty much anywhere but I usually just use equip equip towers and this glitch is 100% solo you don't need two consoles you don't need net cut for this this is 100% easy very much solo anyone can do this it works on PlayStation 4 PlayStation 5 Xbox X and S and works on Xbox Ox One as well, but you have to have the new summer update, the new DLC in order to do this glitch. So you just want to make your way to your nearest by apartment and go inside and save the outfit as so. So we just got here to my apartment. We just want to go up here to the blue circle and go inside and then make my way up there to my closet where we change our outfit and choose what outfit we want to 
you put on and just save the outfit in a outfit slot. It does not matter which outfit slot we put it in. But like I said, if you did do this with the outfit that you did do the telescope glitch on, on it will undo the telescope glitch and if you go do the telescope glitch after saving this as I will tell you this here it will take away the IA badge so I just want to press right on d-pad and you want to go to oh, custom, edit custom outfits and you just want to find a empty slot and we're just going to name this custom outfit 3 so there we go it is saved so now we want to just equip the outfit a couple of times so just go style So once we did that a couple of times, now we just want to pull up our phone and we want to go to the job and we want to quit the job. Once we quit, we will load into a session and it will put us inside a public session even though we were invite only before starting the job and we will have the outfit. So as you see, I loaded in. And I do have my new outfit with the IA badge on it. And there you go. And that is how you successfully make the new outfits with the IA badge at, without doing director mode. Because director mode is patched on new gen. And now director mode does work on old gen still. Ill, but... Um, new gen it does not uh, but this glitch is very easy very solo very very much easy no net cut no two consoles involved all oh, don't have to give people in your login to your account you don't have to go buy a second console and all that good stuff you just don't have to it's very easy very simple all oh, um all you have to do, you can start up the job by yourself. You just got to create the playlist, put on the outfit that you want to, park your car inside the circle, as I showed you earlier, and you want to equip a parachute, and there you go. You have successfully done the IAA badge outfit glitch, and now this will be on my outfit. And I can change outfits, and I can come back to this one so it goes style and as you see I am changing outfits and I still have my outfit and there you go I hope you found this glitch very successful and if you need help with it please let me know and I will catch you inside my next video